everyone welcome back to the map of mathematics in this video we are going to solve this nice algebra problem and here we have n equals to 1 plus square root 5 over 2 uh, and we will solve this problem for the value of n to the power of 12 so here you see that this ratio is known as the golden ratio and we will let's solve this problem and we can just find the value of n to the power of 12 so uh, for uh, find the value of n to the power of 12 first i can take or i can just simplify over this golden ratio and here we write this term as so here we move this to the right hand side and we will write it as 2 to the power of n equals to 1 plus square root of 5 and after this step uh, we will again move this plus 1 to the left hand side and here we will get the value here 2 times of n minus 1 equals to square root of 5 and after this step uh, we need to remove this square sign here so that uh, I can just take the square on both of the sides so when you take the square on both of the sides then its right hand side will be uh, simplified here and left hand side also so here in the left hand side we will use the nice identity you know that uh, if we have a minus b whole squared equals to a squared minus 2 times of a b plus b square so here we need to use this nice formula so our left hand side of the above expression will be written as in the form of 2n square minus 2 times of 2n into 1 plus 1 square so here I we will just need uh, use here this nice formula in the left hand side and we get its output in this form and after that you will see here this 2n square root are cancelled by each other and we get only 5 and now uh, here we need to uh, simplify the terms and here you get four times two times of n and this whole square equals to four times of n squared minus here you have two times of two n will be equals to four n and one square will becomes one and we move this five in the left hand side and you get here minus five and this whole equation equals to zero so here we need to simplify these terms so you get here 4 times of n squared minus 4 times of n minus 4 equals to 0 because when you subtract this 1 by minus 5 and you will get here minus 4 so now here uh, we will just divide both of the sides by 4 because here 4 be the common term so we will divide both of the sides by 4 and now you will see here this 4 and 4 are cancelled here and you obtain n squared these are also gone and you get minus n these are gone and you get minus 1 equals to 0 over something equals to 0 so after this step we will move this minus n and minus 1 in the right hand side and you will get here n squared equals to n plus 1 so uh, this is the value of n square and i can name this as equation number one so here uh, to further uh, find the value of n to the power of 12 we need this value here so now uh, we move uh, towards our uh, target so our target is to find the value of n to the power of 12 and we will write this n to the power of 12 as n squared and its whole power 6 so now we put the value of n square here so n square equals to n plus 1 when we put here it will becomes n plus 1 and its whole power 6 so now we write n plus 1 and its whole power 6 as n plus 1 whole square and its whole cubed so now uh, we, here we again need this nice formula so we can use this nice formula and we will uh, evaluate its right hand side so now here we expand the formula of n plus 1 whole square and it will becomes in the form of n squared plus 2 times of n plus 1 and its whole cubed and in the left hand side we have n to the power of 12 
सो हेयर वी अगेन यूज द वैल्यू ऑफ एन स्क्र हेयर एंड वी नो दैट एन स्क्र इक्वल्स टू एन प्लस वन सो वी बैक सब्टीट्यूट द वैल्यू ऑफ एन प्लस वन and it will becomes n plus 1 and plus 2 n plus 1 and it's whole cubed so in the next step we will simplify these terms here and we can just add the like terms so that uh, the like terms are n plus 2 n equals to 3 n and 1 plus 1 equals to 2 and it's whole cubed and now we can write uh, To three n plus two whole cubed as three n plus two whole squared into three n plus two because uh, here we use the nice exponential law and you know that if we have a to the power of m plus n it is equals to a to the power of m times of a to the power of n so now we can use here this nice exponential law and we can simplify 3n plus 2 whole cubed in this form and now we again uh, apply or use here the nice square identity and you will get here 9 squared plus uh, uh, 12 times of n and plus 4 into here we have 3n plus 2 and now in the next step we will again use the value of n square and you can put here uh, this n square by uh, n plus 1 and plus here we have 12 times of n plus 4 into here you have 3n plus 2 and now we can multiply this n on both of the terms and we will add the like terms here uh, and we obtain 9 times of n plus 9 and plus 12 times of n plus 4 into 3n plus 2 so now again we will add the like terms here and you will obtain 12n plus n equals to 21n and we have uh, uh, 9 plus 4 equals to 13 into we have 3n plus 2 so in the next step we will multiply these two factors here and we will get when you multiply 21n by 3n so you will get here 63 times of n squared and when we multiply 21n by 2 then you will get here 42n and now we multiply 13 by 3n you will get here 39 times of n and we multiply 32 by 2 and you get here 26 so in the next step we will again uh, add the like terms and we can use the value of n square here so again you have n square and we will put the value of n square which is n plus 1 and we add the like terms so 42n plus 39n it is equals to 81n plus 26 and now we can multiply the 63 on both of the terms and we get here 63n plus 63 and plus 81n and plus 26 so when you add 63n and 81n so it is equals to 144n and when we add 63 plus 26 it is equals to 89 so this is the value of n to the power of 12 and now uh, finally we have uh, 144 and its whole power n so that we will put the value put the given value of n so the given value of n be the golden ratio so now we will back substitute the value of golden ratio here and you will get 144 times of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 and plus 89 so now we will simplify the terms and you will see here we have these two terms are cancelled by each other and you will get here 72 and we multiply the 72 by these two terms and we get here 72 plus 72 times of a square root of 5 plus 89 and we obtain n to the power of 12 equals to 72 plus 89 it is equals to 161 plus 72 times of a square root of 5 
so this is the our final answer of this problem and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos